This is code.org using variables. This program currently draws a face, it does. <gasps> ooh, ooh, that's kind of a, well, that face was hit, hit by a car or something. Um, but the eyes are two different sizes. Yep. Change the program to use the variable. There's a, oh yeah, notice they have one for, for the size of both eyes and run the code to make sure both eyes are drawn at the same size. Okay. So we just ran it. Here's where I make the size. I could also switch into block mode. It's easier to read sometimes. So variable eye size is 27. Let me see where they use it. Ah, on line 12, when we say, okay, grab some black paint, right? Or grab the color black. That's what we're asking the computer to do. Fill in with black, ellipse 160. Keep in mind, this is X and Y. I know that because look at ellipse, X, Y. So 160 X, as long as you're not running, you can hover the mouse over and it will show you. Also shows you down here. So it's going to draw this eye at 160X and 170Y. So this is the eye on the left, and this one would be the eye on the right. Now this one is drawn with a width of eye size and height of eye size. What the heck is that? Well, eye size. Computer hits this and says, I don't know. Boom. Oh, 27. Okay, so I need a width of 27. Okay, now what's the height? Uh, smack. Oh, 27. And it draws it right there with 27 and 27. Because this next line draws the eye at this location with the width and height of 10. And that's not what we want. Now, you might be tempted to be like, oh, well, I just need to do this. Now they're all 10. Kind of. But if you change the size of this variable, right, change the program to use the variable for both. That's not using the variable for both. You're having the variable match the other eye. So you could change this back to 27. We should instead do the easier thing and replace the eye size here with our variable, right? Instead of using 10, I'm just gonna use this variable eye size again with a capital S. And now they'll match. And what's even better is let me say, I want huge eyes, reset, run, one change, and we can control everything. It makes it really easy to create interactive content. Awesome. Run the program with different values for eye size and choose your favorite. Oh, best part. I love choosing my favorite. Um, I want 65. This guy has big eyes. He's an owl. Ta-da! <laughs> Onward.